I guess it was maybe a month and a half ago. I don't think you've heard this yet, but a month and a half ago, maybe two months, that my um, my wife Courtney woke up and woke me up and said, "Today is the day." And I was like, "Today is the day." What? She said, "Today is the longest you've ever been home in our entire marriage, 19 years, without leaving." And um, that's crazy because I, I think it had only been like 30 days, you know, 35 days. Um, they're used to a dad who's gone a lot, and um, and maybe she can even speak to that. But but you know. There's a, there's a part of me that was worried, like, oh no, I'm gonna be home all the time, they're gonna hate me, you know, or whatever. But, I mean, we fell into a really nice uh, groove and, and, and just having time to, to not be in such a hurry allowed me to, to see that I had this incredible talent. Like, you know, because I'm, I'm her dad. So my, of course she's amazing to me, right? But, but I have to always go like, yeah, but I'm also a professional musician, so where, where is she really there? And it became really clear as we worked on the worship um, songs and stuff that she was a, like for real. And, and I think for me, the time to work on my son's project, he's got a project that's about to release and he's singing for the first time in his life. And, and I'm just so excited about that. Like these are things that I would have never had time to discover. This song wouldn't exist the way that it does, it would not exist if we hadn't had to hit pause. And I know that there's a lot of negatives that have come obviously with, with the quarantine, but the, the incredible benefit of the quarantine has been, uh, number one, finding out that my family doesn't hate me. That's nice. <laughs> but number two, being able to work with my daughter and going, oh no, no, if, she, if, if her name was Haven Smith, I'd be like, that girl's got it, you know? And so, that's been just incredible. Same with my son, Avery. Like, if he wasn't my son, I am now certain that I would walk in the room and go like, that kid's amazing, you know? So that's just really cool because I, I don't think I would have ever had a chance to, to breathe to even see that. And how's it been for you? I mean, it's been like a force of habit knowing that he's gone. Like, it's been natural for him to be like, all right, I'm leaving. I don't even know how long he's gone. I'm like, love you. Like, that's what I'm <laughs> used to. Yeah, the first little bit of quarantine, it was like, I was expecting him to be gone sometimes and I'd walk in the studio to like play his piano in there and he'd be there and I was like, oh, you're here. I forgot, you're still home. You know, yeah. and like just knowing that he's here and he's working in the studio now, it's really cool. But ha being able to just walk in and be like, hey, can we work on something I'm doing? Or like, I'll bug him all the time. I'll walk in and I'll be like, I wrote this. Can you listen to it? And he'll be doing like the craziest stuff in there and producing and I'll be like, can, can you listen to it, please? <laughs> like, I'll walk in the studio and I'll be like, okay, let's work, let's go.